Good evening, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube. This is Experience Points, and here we are back with the Stalingrad campaign. As we see the Soviets continue their brilliant victory as they drive back the Axis forces. And here we go, we are going to Gallop slash Star. So, let's see how the magic was done. As this loads up, we've only got one more to go, and then I will begin work on the Stalingrad campaign for the Axis. So that's how the end result is. So let's just go back to the start. Pause this up. And just take a look at the uh, situation to begin with. There are a lot of linked um, supply sources for the enemy, and we are going to try to capture and block off these. Um, we only have two which aren't linked to a road, so this is going to be a stretch on our resources. The units that they have are very strong um, and do take quite a determined effort to get rid of them, but we'll see what we can do. So to begin with, we just um, drive our infantry forward and attack the weaker units to the north. We do want to make sure um, to take note that our artillery unit is forced um, next to this fella so that his artillery in the next turn will be available in the attack. Okay. It's very important here to note that you keep this unit from being able to cross the river because he will go straight for your supply and if your supply is gone, restart. So just keeping that up there. We are trying to block him off. Here we're trying to get rid of this fella. Okay, it's important here that you attack with your tanks first, otherwise you won't be able to destroy and you'll have to disband units and you need all your units. If it is possible to get across the river in your first turn, um, but it all matters about how stubborn the enemy units are. So hopefully we can kill this unit. Um, it's unfortunate. Uh, if you bring this unit down here, it is quite handy as you'll be able to cross him into the river next time. Because there's no way that they can um, stop you from getting across with all these spaces. Um, let's continue supply here because this will be the main supply source for the rest of the game. Um, I have found that cutting off down here is probably the best place to start as any units um, that come through here will instantaneously destroy your um, uh, ability to reclaim land so you just you're gonna waste two turns unfortunately as they move to counter and here we go. So we try to drive our fastest units forward first. We've now just cut this off supply and now we're working on this one. Because units reinforcements do come from here and from here. So you do need to pay attention to that. Okay, this is our first objective to take, so it is important to put the uh, the hard yards into it. And to keep the pressure on this unit. If possible, cut him off from supply. If not, stop him from taking yours. And we just finish up our work down here. Shouldn't be too hard. You can generally take this one well and truly, you know, turn ahead. Um, but here we're just trying to force as much land as we can, trying to eventually capture these supply points. The reinforcements that come are just to. Um, experienced and too well equipped to be able to fight fairly. As you see, <laughs> with an 8 and 5, I've just got nothing that can even get near these guys. So we're going to have to win this um, through sheerly um, being able to outsupply them, cutting them off. Okay, so this guy is now out of supply, which is brilliant. Here we go, we've just cut off one of the other supplies. So if we look now, 
they've only got one left and it's not all that effective so really now all these units should be able to supply okay now we just take the first objective as, as painful as this is there we go I felt it was best to weaken that unit up, but that's not always going to be the case. Do you need to be careful because these units are going to be out of supply, um, and your forces from the north are not going to be as effective as you perhaps like them to be. Okay, we just make sure these guys don't want to link up again, so we cut them off. And we gotta make sure this guy doesn't um, block off our supply source. Probably would have been better to have attacked him with this unit. To make sure he can't go across the river um, and frustrate our efforts. That was weird. Okay, here we go. Gonna want to get our forces ready and do some damage while well, we can, because we have to take. Let's see, oh no, we still have two more turns. This one has to be taken next turn. And there we go, another objective. We actually capture the supply source, and we're trying to. Um, the reason I move this guy down is because even though you have the supply source, if they can bring in units in the surrounding squares, then they'll just attack you when you run completely out of supply. So it's good to know what their radius of reinforcements is. Okay, so he just cut off my supply, but it's better that he did it there than there, because I would have had to attack across the river. Now, we're, they have no supply, and we're just trying to make sure that there's a barrier between these guys and the objective. Um, they can't attack on the next turn, but these units can. So we're making sure that we're not going to like freak out and lose our, um, our objective and have to start again. But as it looks, it's a clear shot with one objective left. Um, yeah, this is all over. And now he can't be resupplied, so the only danger is this one unit here. Oh! No. So good, just making sure they can't resupply, because there is another unit that does come. Okay, yep, there he is. I'm not overly worried about supply now, there's nothing that they can really do. Um, and that was just the worst move he could make. Now I'm just trying to make sure that no reinforcements can come in, pull our forces down to the south, and look, one turn, I've got this objective. These units are mostly being moved as a buffer. Just putting fresh supplied units under here. And just gonna see what we got. Yep, our only danger. He's here, I'm just making sure that he can't do anything. Getting rid of the last place that reinforcements could come through. I'm not worried about him coming back here because he'll be forced to the objective with the way the AI works. Okay. And just using our uh, special ability there. Yeah, even if they cut off the reinforcements, no harm. I'd probably destroy them just because it's fun. I found a major strategy with the Soviets is actually to run the Axis out of supply because in a straight on battle you just can't win. Oh, that was unfortunate. And huzzah! Brilliant victory! Um, let's see, all on turn. So, as you see, it's just about taking the supply and running them out of supply. So, thanks for watching. This has been Experience Points. 
and I hope you've enjoyed this and there's only one more left till we see the Soviets achieve total victory in their own land. Catch you later, Mater.